Hi everybody, it's me. I'm back. It's Rhonda with Flowers More by Rhonda. Okay, <clears throat> I wanted to do a video for this because the young lady who sent this to me, she is just a doll. Uh, I met her per se because um, we haven't actually met face to face. I, um, I guess you could say I e-met her. <laughs> She and I did a swap together in the group Scrapbook Friends or More a few months back, and we did a altered shadow box swap. My first time I ever altered a shadow box, and I had a ball with it, and I was rather pleased and tickled with it. And uh, ever since then, she has just... Um, you know, we've kept in, in touch. She's just, I hope to someday get to actually meet her. Uh, she seems like such a, a wonderful human being. And she has, this is my second uh, little package that I have received from her. And the first one I got by total surprise. And it was just all kinds of little craft goodies. And this time, God love her, she is just amazing. Uh, I haven't gotten into the pocket letter thing that, you know, I know a lot of crafters are absolutely having a ball with, but I sure do enjoy seeing everyone's creations that they do. So I have, um, she is hosting a Advent pocket letter swap. Uh, for Christmas, so that's this will be my first time actually doing a pocket letter, and uh, but God love her, she sent me a Halloween pocket letter, and I was just so amazed. I thought, you know, I'm going to do a video and share her creation with everybody. Uh, her name is Alicia, and uh, she doesn't know that I'm doing this, so I'm not going to say her last name or anything. Uh, but this this young lady, she's just a doll. She's such a sweetheart. And I wanted to share this with you. I got it a couple of days ago. And I've, I've tried to avoid her a little bit online because, you know, I didn't want her to know that I had it just yet. And I want, like I said, I wanted to share it. And uh, anyone who, who's friends with me on Facebook knows that I do a lot of the American Legion posts. So my Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays are my three busiest days of the week because um, we cook. Uh, for the American Legion on Thursdays, but Wednesdays I'm prepping and preparing, and then Wednesday we're up there all day, and then on Fridays I'm doing my last minute organization of everything, cleaning up everything, and getting ready, planning for the next week. So anyhow, uh, tonight was a night of my videos, so, um, but here's what uh, I got. Uh, of course, the pocket letter, she has a dish towel wrapped around it, with this beautiful ribbon and she has some Halloween washi tape and that's the cutest and then a fun little skeleton Woo! so I'm going to I'm not going to untie this I'm just going to slide this out and I'll lay this over here to the side and I'm working on Halloween centerpieces so I have everything in a mess and then when I opened it up I was like oh my gosh is this the cutest thing ever and I love froggies. Not too many people know that. So when I see the froggy, I was like, oh my gosh. But she has all these cute little Halloween dies. And, and little stickers. And little foamy. Oh, he lost a foot. Hang on, let me put his little foot back. There we go. Fixed it. And then all this ribbon. I just love this. I see when I go and do something like this, I don't like the looks of it. Somebody else does it, I love it. And we have a little spooky, spooky key. Adorable. And, you know, I don't really know the story behind the pocket letters completely. I'm thinking that the purpose in the pocket letter... Now, if I'm, like, totally wrong, anyone can correct me. Uh, but I think, you know, it's like every little thing you're supposed to be able to, like, reuse... I could be wrong there because, you know, like I said, I'm, I haven't done these. But I think each thing is filled with like little, 
little things that you can use. And of course, this is for Halloween. So, she not only has it filled with fun little craft things, she's got candy. Yum, yum. Now, a lot of people don't know, but I have a food allergy. But, that's okay. That's okay. Because I will share these with my family. But not this. This is a pomegranate raspberry tea. I have to have this for my daughter because she's not getting that. <laughs> she's not getting it. So my husband will help me with these. And then I've got like a chapstick. And I love chapsticks. Yes, I do. And then I've got little bugs here that I can use on Halloween projects. And these are flowers. And, oh shoot, what was that? I opened it up. But now I don't remember. No, anyhow, I'll share this one right here with you. This is candy. Candy, candy. I think it's like a fruit roll-up kind of thingy. Isn't that cute? And it's in a little Halloween container. Adorable. And then this. Oh my gosh, I can't remember what it was. But I mean, how cute. Oh, this was stickers. Yes. Stickers. And if you know anyone with a food allergy, this kind of stuff is awesome to give out to kids at Halloween. So be sure to paint a teal pumpkin and place it on your porch for those who do have food allergies. So they know they can come there and receive something other than candy. And then this is cake batter. Oh my goodness. Yum, yum. Okay, that's got a plastic seal around it, so I won't mess with that. And then, oh, I didn't even see the little stars. I have little star stickers. Or embellishments, rather. I'll put that in there. And then, yeah, there's my, this one's like one of my favorite candies anyways. And then these, you know, you just gave me an idea, Alicia, for the New Year's Eve dance with those. Yay! I bet this is like the best thing ever. Oh, that is a green tea. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy that. Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. And then this has twine. Isn't it pretty? I don't have anything like that. That color. And then here we got little creepy crawly bugs but isn't that cute in each pocket oh so adorable and I'm really digging this over here this is just like the coolest thing ever such fun and then she took and she wrapped the Halloween towel and I'll hang this in my kitchen because I, I still put up my Halloween decorations. My kids are all grown, but I love my Halloween decorations. So, yeah, they'll go up forever, probably, or until they wear out. But I'll hang this in my kitchen because I have witches in my kitchen. I have ghosts in my bathroom. So, anyhow, I want to give a shout-out, though, to my dear, sweet little a friend Alicia God love her she's just a little angel and she likes to support us you know uh, on the design teams that I'm at she's there always supporting everyone and she's she just rocks and she's all the time making stuff for every people and she loves with sending out angel kisses and Alicia you rock girl and I'm glad that I got paired up with her during a swap. And uh, so, but anyhow, sweet dear Alicia, just to let you know, be on the lookout here in the next few weeks because I have a package that is coming your way. And I hope that you enjoy it as much as I'm enjoying this. In addition to my first adorable package of goodies that you sent me. So, anyhow. Uh, be good to your crafty friends, share with your crafty friends, and uh, support your crafty friends. Because that's what it's all about, having fun, you know, meeting people, crafting with them. That's what it's about, 
having fun. Yep. All right, everyone. Till next time, I will see you all. And I hope everyone has a spooky, spooky, creepy Halloween. Thanks for stopping by. Bye-bye.